it's fun. It's it's very educational too. I learn a lot of stuff. It's fun. I love the teachers. I love uh, being a help for school. It's really fun. I want to have academic growth in school. Just by being a good friend to others, like when others feel down or as in or like learning, unlike some kids do, they don't want to learn at school, but like I do, to, you know, get a good job when I grow up and be a, get a good career. The award just confirms what we already know about her. She's just so selfless and thinks about others before she thinks about herself. She's just an amazing kid and uh, has a, a huge future ahead of her and makes me incredibly proud to be her dad. My favorite thing about Gracie is because she's older than me in that she, if like, I don't know something, she'll help me answer it if I don't know it. Um, well, I've been at this school for about seven years and there's definitely a few committees I've been on. Um, I've been part of the SIT, the school improvement team, um, leading goal teams. I'm currently part of um, a social emotional team where we come up with lessons to help students kind of develop those social emotional skills that they need. Um, I'm a sensory classroom too, so I work with other people to help incorporate sensory stations and academics into my classroom. Um, I'm a mentor for a beginning teacher this year, and I've hosted student teachers before. I feel I've grown a lot as a teacher since I've been here. Um, I started off, you know, focusing on the kids in my classroom. I feel like as I've grown, I've kind of encompassed the whole school, not just working with the kids to make sure my kids grow, but as a school, making sure everyone's touched, kind of relationships with kids and staff. I'm just so humongously proud of her. I was a teacher for 25 years, and I know just how hard she works. Her Sundays every night, um, she could not put in more effort, and I'm so glad it's been recognized. I'm very, very proud of her. Miss McGarry is a teacher that works hard to meet the needs of every single student she interacts with. She uses um, home grade teaching, she uses sensory integration practices, she has a true connection with each of her students and she really wants to see them grow and be the best that they can be. Miss McGarry is not afraid to do anything it takes to do what's best for kids. Um, she is just ready and willing to jump in and um, try new practices such as sensory integration and, and, and brain breaks and whole brain teaching. Um, she's involved in professional development and, and serves as a, as a model for other teachers across the school to come and see the practices that she uses with her students. The amount of engagement that her students have in her classroom is truly phenomenal. They sit on her every word and really listen to everything she has to say and want to hear what's happening next in class and be the best they can be. Um, my favorite thing about school is that I get to hear every day and I get to learn something new, so. I would say my mom because she's a hardworking woman and she just makes me proud every day that I just want to be a good student. Um, I think I made an impact because um, I've been helping a lot of people lately, especially Ms. Shalina in our class and she speaks French. She's been like kind of new here and people don't really talk to her so it's kind of nice to help her and feel included because she just came here from France so. I started crying. I couldn't believe it. I was in shock and I just started crying. And all I could say it was, okay. So, um, totally an honor for your peers, you know, to choose you out of almost 100 plus on staff. So, um, it meant a lot and it means a lot. Um, but I just believe in my heart. I don't do it for recognition. I do it for my job because it needs to be done. In my heart, I don't feel like I deserve it um, because I work with several great individuals so out of the seven I really felt like maybe somebody else should have um, but I know that when I serve I serve with my whole heart and I don't, I'm not limited by my death and I jump in and help wherever Miss Hemphill has a whatever it takes attitude. She does whatever it takes to meet the needs of 
anybody and everybody, whether it be a student is sick or a student needs help or a staff member needs something down the hall or um, to pump everybody up and make them excited about, um, you know, celebrations. Ms. Hemphill is a definite go-getter. She always puts 100% into everything she does. She's the front porch of our school. She greets every person with a smiling face as they walk into the school just to ensure that we're providing a welcoming environment for our students and staff and community. Suspecting because we've had a great improvement on our um, data which shows the kids who are getting ready to graduate are in better shape to graduate. The grades are much higher and their attendance is much higher. Uh, I was completely surprised. <laughs> I would hope that it's because I make the teacher's jobs a little bit easier. Very surprised. They sort of cornered me coming out of an office and surprised me totally with it. I thought it was great. It has motivated me to strive and live out to my full potential. Um, it makes me feel happy to be able to serve others and to be able to like give back to the community whenever they do so much for me. I hope that them knowing that I got the award will help them to achieve and to strive to achieve their goals. We're just excited for her. She deserves very, it. She's a great, good. she's a great young lady. And we've noticed that all along, so we were just thrilled to death that she got this recognition. She just considers everybody equal. She she thinks a lot of people. I'll tell you a comment that she made to me when she was eight years old. I never forgot it. But she told me, she said, you know, Mom, she said, there is no one better than anyone else. She said, some people just make bad decisions. But everybody's good. Everybody's equal. I'm honored and humbled to be included among such an amazing group of people. The classroom, the Impact Award, I think, has given me more motivation to continue moving forward and you know given me more motivation to continue to be involved in my community. Being in the community and being a good student really does have an impact um, and that you know you people do receive recognition for these sort of things so it's important to kind of try in your own way. Mm -hmm.